will use double strands of yarn to crochet the tail of the mother shrimp. Working to a chain, first make slip knot in this way. Pull the hook into the loop. Pull the yarn to adjust the size of the loop. As long as the hook can move freely in the loop, the yarn's tightness is suitable. Wrap the yarn around your little finger. And then bring it up to index finger. Pinch the yarn tail with your thumb and middle finger. In round one, start with five chain stitches. Yarn hook, and pull the yarn through the loop on the hook. That's a chain stitch. Such a V-shape is formed on the side. Place a marker in the first chain stitch through the left loop of the V-shape. Continue to work for more chain stitches. Five chain stitches are done. We'll work through the loops on one side of the chain. And then work through the other side of the chain. Turn, skip the first chain stitch and work three slip stitches from the second chain stitch. Find the second chain stitch. Insert hook through the left loop of the second chain. Yarn hook and pull up loop. Then pull the first loop through the ranger loop on the hook. That's one slip stitch. Mark the first stitch. Continue to work two more snip stitches in the same way. Three snip stitches are done. Then work four half tap crochets in the same stitch. Remove marker, yarn hook, insert hook into the left loop of the mark stitch, hook the yarn, and pull up loop. There are three loops on the hook now. 
yarn hook, and pull through all three loops on the hook. That's one half double crochet. Half double crochet. First, work two chain stitches. Turn over the fabric, we are going to work a half double crochet. Yarn hook and insert hook into the stitch. Throw the underneath of the way. Hook the yarn and pull up loop. There are three loops on the hook. OK. Yarn hook and pull through all three loops. That's a half double crochet. Then work three more half double crochets in the same way. Yarn hook, insert hook into the same stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up loop. Yarn hook, pull the yarn through all three loops. The second half double crochet is done. Continue to work two more half double crochets in the same way. Four half double crochets done. Then we'll work through the loops on the other side. Work three slip stitches. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Make sure to tighten up when working the slip stitch. Break yarn leaving a long yarn tail. Pull the yarn tail out. We'll use this non yarn tail for sewing later. Turn the fabric. There is a shorter yarn tail on the back. Thread this yarn tail through the needle. Conceal the yarn tail inside the fabric like this. And finally, cut off axis end. One tail is completed. Please crochet one more tail for the mother shrimp in the same way. Two tails are completed. Please crochet two tails for the baby shrimp in the same way by yourself. Use single strand of orange yarn and a 2.5 mm hook for the baby shrimp. Two tails for the baby shrimp are completed. 